Hey guys, so I was doing some troubleshooting on my ASUS GT AX11000 router that I've had for about a month. When I initially set it up, I did a quick speedtest.net run just to see how it was performing. And I was only getting around 100 megabits per second, which was quite a bit lower than what I was expecting as I have gigabit fiber service. So I'll show you what I did to figure it out. Uh, so this is the web browser version of the monitoring. I'm not sure if there's an actual name for it, but I went to advanced settings, network map, and then bear with me a second. So this is also the, the network map page, but on the far right hand side, I'm just trying to show as little info as possible, but there's a system status tab under status. And this is what shows the CPU and RAM, which the ASUS app has. And I was wondering where that info was within the browser version. And I wouldn't have guessed in the network map page, but here it is. And the exact thing that tipped me off is that my WAM port status was 100 megabits per second. And I had some other ones that were, you know, one gigabit. So why was this one only 100? And what I did is I just went back to the, the modem and just started working my way backwards, testing different cables, seeing where the I was losing speed. And what I found is the ethernet cable between the modem and the, the WAN was, the WAN port was, it looked like this. And I'm not sure if you can see it, but on the far right, the wire, the brown, there's a brown wire that is missing a gold, it's like a gold crimp that like stabs into the wire to make a connection. And I'm not sure if that fell off when I was plugging in the port or if the crimper, you know, if it broke at that time. But I am kind of surprised it was able to work and I've been using it for a month. But that was it. Problem solved. I just, you know, chopped it off, made a new termination on it, plugged it back in. And the web browser version here just immediately said it was one gigabit per second and my speed is as expected. So I hope this helps someone.